This this is Mahmoud Hassan Meraz. Welcome to another solution tutorial of SolidWorks. Today we are going to solve this 3D problem. In this 3D problem, this is our isometric view. And in uh, this isometric view, first of all, I am going I will going to draw this L shape. Okay. In this L shape, uh, we will draw a vertical line. This one and this vertical line has a distance of 10 unit by plus 20 unit plus 10 units. So its total distance is 40 unit. Okay. Then we will draw this horizontal line and this horizontal line has a dimension of 40 unit. After that we can see it we have we will use offset unit uh, to offset this line and we have an offset unit of 10 unit here okay. After that we will use the cap int to cap this int. Now we will going to use the extrude boss and we will going to extrude boss it to 40 unit. Then here we have our this shape. For doing this shape we can draw in many ways. First of all, I will select this plane as a sketch plane, this top plane, top surface, and then I will use a corner rectangle to draw this rectangle. And this rectangle has a dimension of 30 by, uh, we can see in here, uh, it has a dimension of 20 minus 10 unit. So this distance is 10 unit. Okay. Then I will extrude boss. Then we will extrude boss it to 10 unit. Okay. Then in the same way, we will draw another corner rectangle like this one. And this corner rectangle has a distance of 20 unit here and in along this side it has a, a same 20 minus 10 unit so it will be also 10 unit then we will use the extra boss tool and in our extra boss 20 minus 10 unit so this will also extra boss to 10 unit so let's go back to our soyros so first of all i'm selecting the front plane here now right click on it now sketch then normal to it then uh, we will going to select the line tool from here and placing the line tool here and drawing a vertical line and our this vertical line has a dimension of 40 unit okay in the same way uh, we will going to draw another line so in, along this horizontal line and the our this horizontal line has a dimension of 40 units now we can see uh, we will going to offset it for that i am going to select the offset units and we will going to offset of 10 units i am offset this line and along this line so make sure to select cap int now line okay now press ok our this offset has been done now isometric it for a better view now go to uh, features and then extrude boss we will going to extrude boss it to 10 units okay mm, we will going to extrude boss it to 40 units so we will going to extrude boss it to 40 units and now press ok so our extrude boss has been done now select this upper face now right click on it now sketch the normal to it now we are going to select the corner rectangle uh, and place it here and we will draw a rectangle of 30 by 10 units ok now I may take it for a better view now go to features and now extra boss we are going to extra boss it to 10 units ok so we are going to extra boss it to 10 units now press ok in the same way, we will draw another rectangle of 20, uh, 20 unit wide, uh, 20 unit length. Okay. So I am selecting the corner rectangle again and placing the corner rectangle here. And this corner rectangle uh, has a dimension of 20 by 10 units. Okay. So I am dimensioning it to 20 by 10 units. Now I should take it for a better view. Now go to features. Now extrude boss. We will going to extrude boss it to 10 units. So we will going to extrude boss it to 10 units. Now press OK. So as you can see, we have drawn our 3D sketch. Thank you for watching. Till the end. Thanks for watching and keep learning. Be different.